Hi there, Zork Tim, and today we're doing another battle report of Rangers of the Shadow Deep. We are playing our second scenario through, um, I think the first, it was called, uh, the, the mission is called um, Questable Plant Life. Uh, we did the first, uh, that's the mission, and the, and this na the first scenario was called The Great Root, and we're now playing uh, the second scenario, and I, hold on. And it's called Overgrown Tower. Uh, it's, I think the name of the title gives it away. So we need to head towards the tower and sort the problem inside the tower. Um, and I think most of you know that if you know the, the scenario, generally you can find it, but we need to deal with more big nasty plants. What else would it be? Um, if you remember, we found some quite nice stuff uh, in the last scenario. We found, uh, I think, some fairy dust, some a potion, some um, I think we found some um, a book or journal as well that is pretty good, and we also found some sweet, um, sweet, uh, sweet um, nectar. Uh, the sweet nectar, if you remember, uh, can if you drink it, you get plus two to your health, and it goes all for your health. I've gave that to John because he's. One of the week is and he's got no armor, so he, so he can't. I think he, he's the only one that can die the most, the quickest. Uh, I think everyone else is at twelve root wounds. So if anyone that I think like as low as Chloe, but I don't expect to get much. I, I don't want to get a combat. Her point is she's to use a crossbow. Um, he's got the sweet nectar. Haley, I gave Haley the fairy dust. Uh, if you remember that is a account, uh, is a new one user item. It counts as a weapon being massacre, so it gets plus one the hit. And some creatures only can take massive effect, but it also gives you plus one to hit as well. Um, with the book, I chose to give that to my ranger, and the main reason is my ranger is my big heavy hitter. He, if he hits you, he gets plus four base hit, and he does win. That's uh, what his dice roll plus four. Plus an added two for his double-handed sword, that is a plus six damage. So if he gets like a fly and he just hits his heart, uh, past his armor, I can really able to kill anything at least. So that's the whole point um, of him. He's built to hit you and hit your heart at the right moment of the time. Um, also, I gave him the spell that um, potion that he can if um, use his spell twice if I want to. And generally, that's all the equipment went to. Uh, in if you remember, in in here we have the ranger. I think Haley. We got six well, a companions with us. If you remember, we got Haley, Chloe, and I think Andrew, our battle mage. And I've got um, William took our alchemist. Paul, not Paul, sorry, Mike. One got wrong person, and John our. Um, Archaeologist. Uh, I know he's got a proper different name, but that's what you call him. That. Uh, this scenario lasts for eight turns. Um, we need to solve the problem, I think you guess, in the middle of the tower. Um, they is another dark root body, a big, uh, as same in the last scenario, but the difference is it's one of the big, big enemy now. Uh, it has Fight plus four instead of plus three and 26 health instead of 18. So this one's got eight more wounds. But we have upper scenario there. Are five clue markers, but each clue marker you not be able to see because they're underneath an item. Um, and I hope you, I really um, like the, how I set the board up. I got, um, I think, you, a new map that's more brighter green. And something else uh, I picked up really cheap. It's a bit random, but I think you will notice quite quickly. But it just makes it a little the depth of it slightly different. That's it. Um, but otherwise, that is it. Um, oh, I know. I was using some, some of the new uh, ear raptor scenery as well, and they do look really nice. And it just saw um, how I did. It. I think it sorts out really well. So I hope you enjoy it. I think I, I hope you. Uh, I think I did quite well setting, setting this one up. Um, and generally, that is it. Um, there's two. Get in, find something, I uh, think there to find something, and then leave, and that generally does it. And that, um, and that will be the end of this 
um, scenario. This will only last two scenarios. Then we go back to our base and discuss what we found with the king. And then we could carry on next uh, scenario two for this group. Uh, well, this one. Um, and see what generally happens. Hopefully they do well. And uh, we wait and see. So uh, sit back and enjoy the battle report. Many thanks. Hello there, welcome to um, the battle report. Uh, this is their map I set out. Um, I We have the ruined, and uh, this now is called the ruined tower, or the overgrown tower, sorry, my bad. This is our tower. It has the main big plant body in there again. Uh, the difference with this one, it is bigger than the last one. Um, this is the basic, body you fight so fight three 18 health and armor 14 this one is fight fail plus four and health 26 so um it's a lot larger um i thought i would feel like a ruin um um area a little bit uh with um boulders around that where the other things um saints collapse I bought some really random turf. I thought it just makes it look different and a little bit more overgrown. And um, it does, and it looks quite nice, not too bad. Uh, just something different. Um, we still got the same range of pie than last game. We have Chloe over here behind the tree uh, with Michael, William Took, our alchemist, uh, Michael's a swordsman. Hayley's here next to our ranger, then our ranger's here next to John, our Al um, archaeologist, and then Andrew, our battle mage. And that's what I chose to come on this side. Fisty, it's bang, it's bang in the middle. It's tremendous and different. I just wanted to come this way. Um, so you can see everything on. Uh, when I get past that big tree, a couple of trees, you can see the other three. Um, also, this has a couple of special rules. Around three inches off the tower are these big roots you can see these that one's not the best one there we go that these ones you've got one uh opposite there are big roots uh, underneath them is a clue marker and after the big uh plant is enough clue marker um we so if it's the in the tower and uh, three inches around the tower it's difficult terrain um we have one fine next to each root because these are big roots supposed to be and then we got three other ones around the base of the tower so we got quite a lot already we got seven um like i said uh, we can pull these up we need a i think uh, we need a strength test to pull them up and uh, we need a success on a 10 plus to pull them up michael has got strength um so he's the only one that has I don't think my ranger even got strength. Hold on. Oh no, I got, my ranger has strength too. So two guys have got strength. So that's brilliant. Uh, and the big one we can pull up. If we do do that, we kill it outright, but we need two people and it's difficult 14. So it's going to be hard to do that. So we can kill it or do it. We have eight turns to do it. And also, is if any of our guys are in here, the three inches of the tower, we didn't. The, um, the killer plant can do like a, it says magical um, attack, but it's fizzy. Is is um, is um, one of these fires coming up, whacking you. So it is a plus three magical attack. The die root body does not. It uh, does not need line sight. So fizzy, um, it will pick the lowest health guy in in there when we get close. And Jeremy, that is it. Um, and and that's it. We have got um, I think eight different um, event cards. We have two doubles because it can say um, you can put more in there. So I put two in there. Um, Nope, that's not it. And that's generally it. So hopefully our guys will do well. We will wait and see. 
And then um, and that's it. So so that's it. So that's uh, what I said. Go around. Um, we need to get the centre, kill the plant again, find, get the clue markers. Uh, we need to pull, pull the roots out to get the clue markers. Um, kill, um, kill the plant. It has another clue marker. And um, but we can get hit when you do that when the plants uh, because the plant can hit us and it's a bigger plant. Um, I think that says it all. So brain to face. I will activate. Um, Haley and Andrew. So I'm going to move six. I will, for my second action, I will give Armour to at John again. So he's now R12. So he will, because he moved nine. This is not difficult terrain. I just want to make it look nice. So everything's moving double, and that is end of my go. So bad guys go. Um, the finds will move. Will stop coming towards. Everybody, but I think. Wait. Ooh. I'm just out. So this one is in combat with Haley, but it's out six inches. Do -do. So so we need to. Plant here to do that. So that's the enemy move or the finds move because the finds can move. The roots and nothing else can uh, can't hit us, and the big one plant can't hit us because we're not in the um, area of the of the thing. Yeah. So. Rest of the guys. Um, Andrew's going to move nine on top of the hill. Um, Pippin, so William, sorry, William will move here and oh, I didn't realise I was just bunting. Not even out. Even thinking. Um, throw his thing. He will hit all three. Oops, I would not move in there like that if I would pay attention of um, everything. So, the purple dice is the bad guys. They get plus one because the basic. But pit, and also pit, uh, William moves another one, so he gets plus the, the first one. They both all get plus two. And William gets plus two, so it's mostly it's more, more at roll here is what he calls. So, the first one in the back. Um, the rows are two with Pippin uh, two. It's armor ten. The roots are. Um, so it does do damage. They have six health. It's still alive with four wounds. Next one. Um, ten. Next one has three wounds left, and the next one. 15 it has a whole wound, one wound left and that is extremely surprising how well so Chloe will move in she will shoot at the one in front again plus two oh. uh, 12 uh, Plus two is 14, and her crossbow does that extra two damage. She does take that one out. And Michael will just run into combat and closest one, get over done with. Uh, he can't do anything because 
he's um yeah in base um he ran his nine so that's the end of first turn uh i'm not sure what i said i might did but this has eight turns so turn one so it's turn two let's put the dice up here so i won't forget so first one is a five for a fence deck all right okay Overthrown, place two dark root finds in contact with the two heroes that are closer to the dark root body. So we have. William is 10, Haley's 11, Saint Michael. It is going to be William. Is it base contact? Uh, Uh, find the co uh, in contact with two, uh, within two, um, find in contact with the, with the two. Oh, bro, place two finds in contact with the two heroes that are close. Okay. So, hey, now Haley's got two. <laughs> and William's got one. So, they're the closer one. They're ten each. So. Okay. Not what I want. Killed one. And now two more popped up. This blood's not happy. So, turn two. I will ask fate. I think I will ask fate, Andrew, and me. So, Andrew will go in plus with me. And then, good thing is, no, sorry, I'll go all around because I can't, and I'll just go there. Um, I do get support because we do outnumber them. Thanks to Andrew. Oh yeah, my second one is Haley. Andrew and Haley. I'm not sure I've said what activates well. So Ranger, he gets plus four basic plus two, so he gets six plus six. Um, he gets eighteen, thirteen. Uh, plus, so seventeen plus one's eighteen. Uh, thirteen plus six is nineteen. I beat it by one by just. Uh, it only has six health. I take it out. Um, so I'm going to give it a try. John, uh, so Andrew was going to attack. He gets plus four. Uh, he gets six plus four. Um, I think that is it. So I think he doesn't do anything to it. Yeah, plus two, plus two, that's ten. So it's four plus one's five, so nothing. So Haley, because I said Haley, Haley gets plus five. Um, nope. Uh, the both are three, but plus five. Um, I'll put it out of combat. And now I'll keep it in. So that is it. Um, bad guys go. Um, it's the uh, wounded first, so the one first is Michael. Michael gets plus four. Um, Mike got seven. Oh, god, seven plus four is eleven with hits five plus one. Uh, that is three, that's ten. It Michael just kills it by um, with eleven. Oh, armor eleven. He, yeah. Just kills it barely. The one, so the three will charge into Haley because it's injured. So, hey, uh, so not Haley, Chloe. Chloe goes to 17, two is five, plus one. Um, Chloe gets plus two with only ten armor, ten, six health, and losing three already. Chloe takes it out. One against Pippin, uh, sorry, not Pippin, Mary, not Mary, God, William, got the two upper holes in my head, I do not know why, so, William, um, I think William only has a plus, um, I think one in combat, yes, and you get plus one, so, 
He's plus one is six, two is 15, plus one 16, but I'll ignore that plus one anyway, because he's got light armor. He is losing five health. He has uh, 12 minus five, that is two. He has eight left, William does. So, right, to help you on. So, one against Haley, plus two. A rose of 12, 13 to Haley's nine, plus three, it's 12. Plus two it is I say eleven plus three is fourteen. It's still alive with two wounds left. And Haley will just keep it in combat because it's now the first one is in me. Um, I wrote um, it wrote a, a good 14 plus one's 15. I rolled a 16 plus four is 20 with all the uh, I gotta smite it. If I hit something, I generally now kill it. Right, um, oh, this one's in contact with Andrew, so he does hit Andrew. So, can Andrew die again? Uh, right. Andrew, Andrew Rose 6, minus 1, uh, plus 2 is 8, it's Rose at 18, plus 1, it's 19, but it has 8. So it does, Andrew does take <laughs> some more damage, and he he is down to 2 wounds. Because um, he takes, it's plus 1, so 18, he's got light armor, um, nor, ignores that, he's only has 10 health, minus, um, so that's still 18, um, so he's down to 2. Uh, nine. Oh. No, Andrew is closer, but he's in seven. Did we do the one against? Ha oh yeah, Haley has two wounds. So yeah, right. That is it. Um, right, companion phase. Michael will go into the first route. Uh, I know he can help out, but he's the only one's got strength. If we pull up the route, I think the plant loses four health. Uh, but he will can uh, next turn he can get hit by it. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. It's good, difficult ten. If we pull up the route towards uh, it says on the on the chart, remove the route and destroy uh, and deal uh, deals for damage. So. I don't know what I'm doing. It's not drawing to two attacks. So Michael uh, has strength, so he gets plus three, so he needs to seven or more. He rose a 12, so that pass. He takes out the first route. I want to get a d20 because of that big thing. So it is on 20. I'm going to put it up here, 22 health. And two. So, so, first route being pulled up. Um, success on the check, remove the route. Deals four damage of the damage to the dark root body. If that happens during the dark root body, Nick that's facing, it will use his massive attack to attack to heal. That was the what last one who moved through. So it's going to automatically hit Chuck Michael, doesn't matter. Uh, and he will um, roll on the chart for the. When you move the root, he can roll on the um, food mark chart. Uh, only one of them can't. Ah, blah, blah. He rolls 16. Herbs. Is this the right one? Nope, I don't think we are. So, hold on. Still 16 anyway. Um, a strange book. I swear he, he found the strange book. He found, he found it last time, didn't he? A strange book left over from the 
uh, period inhabit of the Ruins Tower. After the game, pick one figure to make a Arkham Law roll, difficult eight, to identify if it devour it. If it, if success, the figure understands the cry point. Wandering, wandering is tied to a Arkham, um, Arkham myth of the of the land. Okay, brilliant. Okay, so we need to roll. We found a book. A book. I did. Ah, there you go. There's my piece of paper. We found a strange book. And one, two, three. One, two, three. So one, two, three, four. So all the ones around, so we killed one, two, three, four, five. We found we killed five so far. Um but Andrew's in a pile mess. It's because we uh we killed five roots so far, the reason why I'm counting. Because uh, we had four in each corner, plus three, that's seven. Then we got two more X ones, so that's nine. And we got one, two, three, four on the table, uh, and that's what we got. So, John, um, I think John's going to move all around and help the one against Haley because if we can kill. Uh, well, he can go there, because I think where the dice is, yeah, John can get in. So, John's aiming for Hayley, he does get bonus, bonus, because it isn't, he's only against that one. Um, it rolls, luck enough, uh, the both row 11, with John's plus 4, it gets 15, to it's uh, plus 1, so it's 12. He's only got 2 health left, John does get rid of enough for 5. So now Andrew doesn't have six around him, <laughs> three around him, and all right. Uh, Chloe's going to help um, Pippin. So not Pippin, William. So Chloe's going to charge. To twelve plus one is twelve. That is a nine because next to it's a six. So you can see the line there. It's a six, and the lines on the uh, not the brown bit on the. Um, curly line bit so that is a nine plus four so that's two is eleven plus three is thirteen and that's thirteen so say so hold on it's four as two is eleven thirteen it takes three points of damage uh Chloe will push it back into the woods with free health, freeing up William. So William's going to move free, free. And he is, yeah, he's going to have a go. I won't move that clue marker. At a thing. It is going to, pl it, it has a plus five to William's. Oh, I can say no. That's failed. <laughs> no, <laughs> Rose at eight. So he's only got two cocktails left, and that is it. So, end of turn two. We got a three. The poison miss a fine foul. Gas rays from the thickness, uh, or the thicken, thickness of uh, undergrowth. Every hill figure standing on the rough terrain must make a healthy roll of difficult fourteen or become poison. Only Michael's in it. Uh, he's fine. He's rolled to twelve because I realise what health checks there. So in how many wounds you got left? Uh, he firstly he needs to uh, roll a two to fail. He rolls a two. No. He's on, uh, he, no, he, um, he needs a, a 1 because he's on 13 health. So, yeah, he automatically pass. Uh, he, no, he doesn't automatically pass. A 1 is always a fail. Um, so, he's he's fine. So, it, uh, if, if that happened, he just becomes poison. 
But health rolls, if it's one of the easy, I think one of the easy ones to pass. Um, I would genuinely say because if you're not took any damage, you don't die. So that is it. So ranger phase, I will activate. I'll activate Haley and John. I will go in. John and Haley will go in as well. But on the other one. So I do get plus two because it's now Andrew and me on one. And then these two on the other one. So Andrew and me, but I go first. So I rolled, oh, I rolled an at 20 to it's 19. I completely obliterated it. It rolled, I tell you if it still rolled really high. Um, this one, Haley, gonna go first. Haley gets plus. Um, well, um, Haley's gonna win because she gets plus five. Um, and it's she rolls a twelve. It's that's a Sephard already. It's only armor ten with six health. She kills it. So, and that is the end of the range phase. Right. We have killed all the roots. Uh, so killed the vines. So now the roots. Uh, the roots going to aim for John. So not John, Michael, because he took root out. Uh, the roll of both double one. <laughs> I'm not gonna. Um, it's not gonna make no difference because all the extra bonuses can't do anything. Um, it doesn't need a. It doesn't need a line sign. So no card cover, no light cover, and no nothing. It's just a plus three basic to your um dice roll. But otherwise, that's it. Oh no, this this minus this one goes back into Chloe. I completely forgot about this one. So this one's five Chloe. Uh, Chloe two is nine plus one is ten. Chloe is fourteen plus two. Sorry, um, it will kill it because it's only on three wounds. So all the far finds are gone. So. Next, so uh, companion phase. Uh, Andrew will move here for nine. Chloe will load, moves six along. She's not thing. Um, move back out for two, so it moves four. So Michael's really goes there. So he's going to move back out from the difficult terrain um, because William's in it. Haley, um, Chloe reloads and moves so she can get a better shot at it. But generally, that is it. That's John's, Andrew's, and that is it. Turn four, so halfway. We have a ace. This is not good. Troll. A troll that has made its home has returned from hunting. All over its body, it has a deadly fungus. Treat all, all the trolls attack as poison. In, it enters the table free in from the center of a random board edge. If the during was, um, if the dog was independent, instead choose which board D-U-N-G was identified and said, identify, hold on. Nope, I did not found it. Um, found that, that's what it meant. Uh, it's the stuff in, um, on here, den, but I didn't got the den. Oh, dung, sorry, uh, I, didn't roll the, I didn't got the dung. Uh, dung, if the dung was in play, institute which board as it breaks on. If the card is draw again, draw a new card to place it. You just don't put. Oh yeah, it, 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 you you put the cards back in the deck, but then you, you don't. Just I put an extra cards in. So Mister Tro, I um he has even mushrooms on that. This is if you know this figure. This is a Molog. It's a Molog coming in to join. So. I'm gonna get a D8, because I can buy a lovely D8. Found plenty of D10s. Can't 
Come on. Alright, I found D12. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, it comes in the centre there. Whoopee! What I generally do not want. So, Razor Phase. I will activate John and Haley. I will first thing we'll do plus one strength to myself. Move six there. These two will move five. Haley will try to pull it up. She does need a ten because she has no strength. On the table. She, no, that is not a D20, so we roll that one again. We've got 11 <laughs> on a D12. I feel that's pretty good still, so far. She rolls a 10. She pulls it up. It loses two more health, so that goes down to 218. And it will aim for um, Haley automatically. And John will go, yeah, net run away from the troll. <laughs> Oh no, so that's six on the edge, and he roll and two and a half, so he goes there. Yeah, six, so yeah. So he can't sprint that far. And Haley can't pick that up until next round. That is it. So, any phase. I'm going to do the plant first. Uh, it's going to aim for Haley because Haley pulled up a root. Uh, it rolls a nat 20. So it does 23 damage. Lucky enough, it doesn't crit. Haley has. So 23. Minus 2 from her armor. So that is 21. She has. Uh, say 12. Uh, she has 12 armor. So that is. 13, 11, she has one health left. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, that was a, that's a whack and a half. Damage maximum. Oh, well done. I just noticed it has a spell uh, ability. So I'm going to. Um, he has damage minion. Um, minion. Minimum. So just hold on. Right. Um, I just found out if it. Um, if it. If I shoot it with any ranged weapon, it only can do a maximum of two damage. Uh, so luckily enough, I don't think I shot it. So. Chloe is useless. Um, the only one that can do won't do it is um, William Tucker's um, files because they're different. They will damage it still because of um, what it does. So <clears throat> it's fine. Still kills Haley really bad. So the troll will move four. It's there and it will move to in base combat. It does do nothing because that's all it does. And that is it. So, companion phase. Andrew's using his fireball, aiming thing, uh, the plants in his face. So, he gets plus four to Andrew's plus three. Uh, it will plus Andrew has plus four, it's 19, plus Andrew plus three. Um, it does not do anything, sadly, but Andrew will still move three. Uh, well, move next to that, try and pause that up. They both did. <clears throat> Michael and, uh, will go move three and three. So three of the rocks and then three into this. William will move there. Uh, Chloe will move next to him as well for three. Um, And she will climb the. Uh, she won't climb the ladder because she doesn't want to do that just yet. So, 
that is the companion phase. Brain, um, that's it. So turn five, I need to stop hitting it. Ooh, not turn six, five. We rolled a two, a black two. Heavy rain through um, harness of plant life thrive in the new rainfall, the dark root body, and all five trees generate four hit points. So it is back to 22. So I've got to put the four comma half to change that. So not what I wanted. So Range phase. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm not in free, but I'm going to do Frenchy attack. I think with my ranger. I don't think that's called that. Uh, Frenchy attack. Um, the troll is nasty. Is, uh, well, third troll because we killed two. So they move four. They're very slow. That's why they didn't move. It's fight plus four. Armor fourteen. Plus two will and 16 health. I'm plus five, so I get plus nine to its plus four. Oh, it needed one 20. That was so close. So, we're also 19. Remember, I have plus, uh, I've used my strength on me as well. So, it rose to 19 plus four. That is 23. I have a nine plus nine, but plus four and plus five for frenzy. I beat it. That was worth doing. So, so I plus nine, so that's eighteen. Uh, plus two is twenty. That is twenty-seven. Plus two um, to my double-handed weapon. So that's uh, twenty-nine. And I gave myself strength. My last match spell because I moved six and that. That is thirty damage. It has sixteen. Uh, 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 so he has. 60, um, so the weird thing is armor 14, 16 health, that is bang on 30, I kill it outright, so 14 health soaks it up, so that is 20, um, 26 left, um, so yeah, 40, so it's armor 14, so minus the 30, so that is, um, 20, no, it is 30, so six, it is 14 minus 30 is 16, it has 16 health, I one shot the troll. Troll came, it saw my two handed sword and, bit, and it gets decapitated in one easy swoop. Boom! Oh. That was the right move to do. Very lucky. Very lucky indeed. So, Troll is gone. The biggest threat out there. Gone. Um, and I can still move. So, I will move six here. So, I'm out of pink. So, so, next go. Um, so uh, it's only the big grubbly plant. Um, Haley is generally not counting being in because she was in the base of the root. It, she needs to be in the difficult terrain. She, uh, it says if someone takes the root out, they get hit. Um, John Andrew's out because he's out. Uh, it will be William who's the most injured one. Uh, William um, worries a 17, plus one, 1 to his fight, that's 13, no, 18, 12 plus 4 is 16, William is completely fine, if that was um, Hayley's steel roll, she gets some more shit. Right, companion phase, so, I think Andrew will not do anything, so he will move 3, 3. So at the base of the tower, I think he will lead me to it. Michael will try to pull up the root. He rolls a 12, he does it, does it again. And he will set the clue marker once more. 11, I can't get. So we 
Michael has really found a strange book. He wrote a leaven. He found a crawl, a, a, a crawl draw map. Not a troll. Uh, he's, he's found a map. Oh. There's a map. After the game, pick one figure to make a navigation roll. Difficult six. Uh, and a survival world. So, um, have, uh, John's going to have at this rate. Um, no, not difficult. Um, Um, John's got two rows to make at the end of the game. Um, so, uh, if we do, or to understand it, it is just to figure understand its map leading to a strange grove. So, it could be quite important. All right. And, and that is it. Uh, Michael's done. Um, Chloe will move... I think it is three. Up, oh, yes. Yeah. She is. Uh, no, William is going to go first. He's going to throw his potion at it, so he's got three. Okay, he rose seventeen plus two is nineteen. Uh, it sadly it has plus four. It's nineteen as well. It's a draw. It doesn't go off. Um, and he stays at the bottom. So Chloe's moved three at the halfway at the ladder, and she's going to go there. John goes to move three. I move three up. So he's in base contact as well. Haley is going to move three. Um, Haley's going to stand in the back. She's going to move away. Oh no, Haley will search that. I'm really sorry, and then move back. <laughs> sorry. Oh, she was 20. A weak point. The figure notices the dirt around the root is softened, then elsewhere. Remove this root, increase the strength of the root. Oh, I've been. Oh, okay. We can set the clue markers, but we're getting rid of the roots first, then grabbing the clue markers. Um, well, okay. If she picks up enough roots, she picks strength up, but um, that's it. So. But I can roll down again because it's not special, so you generally can. So it's only two things we can roll. Uh, no, three. We can do the weak point, um, the clue mark, uh, number one or two, sweet nectar again. And yeah. Oh, I'm going to put. I'm going to move John up there. He's going to drink his sweet nectar. So he is um, 12 wounds instead. And that is it. So he's going to move back. And that is it. Because. So yeah, that is it. So companion, uh, range of fate. Uh, so end of fate. So it's turn six. We need to hurry up and hit it. Oh, it loses four more wounds because we took another route. Number four. Uh, spore cloud. The dark root body spends a large cloud of spore into the air. That is current by the wind. All hero figures must make a health roll, difficult 12, or become infected by spores. Infected heroes have minus to all rolls. So, for me, I everything's set at one. Two, I'm fine because uh, it's a health roll. So Andrew, it's going to be he needs a uh, um, he, Andrew needs a lot of stuff. Uh, seven, no, he fails. So seven plus two is nine. Uh, so he's minus to all his rolls. John is fine. Haley, uh, no, she fails. William, he's fine. Michael. 
everything's at one. Yes, yeah, fine. And Chloe, everything's at one. She's fine. She's 17. So Andrew and Hayley are minus one to all roll for the rest of the game. And so what's the 10 6? So, Rage Faye, I will ask Faye. Uh, I think John and Andrew. So, I'm going to pull out the root. I roll horribly with that one. I'm going to root. Yeah, sod it. I'm going to root away. Dang it. Four plus three, seven. That is a waste. So, nothing. So, John then now get up. We'll move up there. Andrew will move three. No, I won't activate Andrew. He stayed there. So, bag of face. Massive tackle goal on Andrew, hello, uh, Michael, because he pulled a rope. No, it doesn't do it anything because he's only four or three. And he will tack. He'll tap. So, hold on. I need to double check. Because John has rolled drink thing and he gets plus two more health. Uh, I think Chloe's on. Oh, Chloe's on 11. John's on 13. So, it's aimed for Chloe. Chloe gets plus four. Chloe rolls a nat 20 to its 16. Uh, hold on. Because Chloe might kill it. <laughs> Plus five, plus four is 29. 29. It's on 18 health. It's armor 14, 29. Uh, so yeah, 29. Uh, 29 minus 14. That is 19. Minus four, that's 15. It has, it takes, it's down to three wounds <laughs> left. That is a brutal, brutal hit it just got there. So, everybody else is going to move up. Michael moved three, and Fisty, he has to go in base contact. There's a ladder uh, against the thing, so he can't get up there. Uh, William, Andrew will move up there. Um, no, Andrew's. Oh, uh, no, Andrew's going to stay where he is. I don't want to. He's no even worse. He's going to stand there and look pretty. So, William will move free and free up the ladder so he's in base contact with it. Um, Haley will. Stand at the back, I think. No, yeah, three and three. Andrew's gonna get out there as well because he doesn't want to take massive damage from either as well because he can do two. So, William's on 18. Uh, William's on at 18. Right, next go. Uh, turn seven. I rolled six of clubs. I have no idea what that one is. Okay. Ne a neutral way. Place two die root fires in contact with the dark root body. They should not be in contact with any hero figures if able. Draw a added offense card. If this card is drawn again, draw a neutral. Oh my god. So we get two new finds. Well, that's free. Number two, Heavy Rain. It heals four more, so it is on seven. Oh, so I'm going to do this. Six and one. So uh, it's in base contact. It's not help. Officially, it's ones at the back there. And ones in that corner away from William. Right, I will try to pull the root up again. 13, I do. 
Um, I it is on four t is on three points of health now. Fact I'm doing that, and I've just pissed it off. I will move a three into it, and that is it. So mass attack. It's going to aim for me because I did the last route. Uh, it rose, I rolled an 18 to plus 4, it rose a uh, mass attack, only got plus 3, so I ignore it. So, firstly, you do the most interesting creeps first. The big thing is more interesting than the lit ones. So, it has to aim for William. I think it, uh, yeah, I think I shouldn't put William up there. So, William gets plus 1, plus 4 for his companion, so he gets plus 5. And saying that, William rose at 18. Plus seven, oh, sorry, 18, plus, oh, Jesus Christ, plus, uh, with, it's only plus seven. William kills it with only three health left. He kills it. And. I put William's health up there. And that is it. So. Uh, the fines. First fine will go into William, but Chloe will snap. It's going to hit William because he's more injured. It rolls a 10 plus 1. Uh, no, William's fine because he's got a light armor, so he gnaws it. The other one will go to John. Uh, well, it does hit John for 18. John has minus 2 to his health because uh, he's got. Arm, and he's got well massacre armor, so he's 15. Um, he has 13 health plus three minus three. He has um, again, he has eight left, like William. So they both have eight. So the come um, move there. John, uh, will, um, Andrew will search that. Oh, three. Let me do this one. Uh, we found some sweetness. Uh, sweet, uh, sweet nectar again. Oink. Right. Oh, that's Andrews. There you go. So, uh, Chloe against the fine. Uh, Rose, eight plus one. Chloe has three. No, double four is nine. Nine is a draw, so nothing. So, John gets his. The uh, bowl? Uh, no. It beats John, but John's armor 12 because thanks to my armor, so he ignores it. Uh, William, now uh, it gets 13 plus the both rolled 13. It's a draw uh, combat, but uh, no, yes, 13 plus. Uh, oh, wait, no, three is 14. So he'll move out of combat and he uh, William will move out of combat because he pushes it away. It's on three health left and his second action will move next to the So yes uh, into the the clue marker so he will pick it up next round so turn eight and number five overgrown place two dark fires in concrete with two heels that are closer to the dark root body uh the body's gone so so there's no body there so they don't appear so they're dead so 
So this is last goal. I will move up, attack uh, that one. So I get a lot. I rolled a 40 plus six is 20. Uh, I do kill this five. Oh, out there, wants to come back. Doesn't have me. Last. Comp uh, enemy goes fine against John. Oh, or is 18 plus one is 19. Um, minus two is 17. I have, he had eight health left, minus seven, it is from eight, He Mike John has two, one wound left. Last goal, William will just uh, pick that up. So, uh, the clue marker up. Uh, a file of nectar from the tree of lies. This is a powerful, outside. we need an archelor of survival at the end of a uh, difficult 16. A survival or Arkham Law. I'll find out who's better. If, uh, uh, if we do, uh, the fire of the nectar, nectar from the tree of life is the nectar of the tree of life. This is a powerful after. Not only does it hold unlike unbelievable healing potion, but it also means the tree is tree is the tree of life is real. I should have said it. So, John's not going to attack because I don't want him to die. So, that's the end of the game. That's turn eight. So, everybody survived. Some really good lucky dice roll on the enemy side because Hayley only got one shotted. Um, and Drew nearly died again. And um, William just took a couple of damage. And John kept, uh, luck enough, he took the sweetness, drank it before I went in there. Brought him back down and give him an armor. He only survived by that dumb luck. <laughs> but right, let's do the end phase. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, this one was enjoyed it. Uh, did pretty well. Kills a troll before he came and did anything. But I was um and kind of knew. I was hoping the trolls can come over there or there straight away. But I have to say, Chloe hitting it for twenty that um with a nat. Makes a lot of difference. That's yeah, Chloe won the game just kidding now, right? Right, so make good the end phase. Right, uh, welcome to the end phase. Well, for a change, we do not roll anybody on the death chart at all. So that is some good news. So hold on, I just need to grab all a piece of paper. So we do need um, a few some things. Uh, roll for, on some charts. Um, Mike's not going to roll anything because, and Chloe isn't because she they got nothing useful. So I can open this one. Uh, William has does got survival plus three. So my scrap piece of paper. I had that not long ago. Now it's gone for walkies. Yeah, paper, paper. There we go, so, right. Beep, 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 beep. So, no place like that there, and have that there, and I will move better. Right, okay. So, we killed nine dark wood, uh, wood uh, dark roots. So, that's nine xp because they're worth one each we did kill the body um as well so eight xp uh if the dark root body is destroyed with no dark root finds are on the table sadly we had one uh, oh so we had two so we did not again score that plus two for each root move so two four six eight for the roots uh we did not find um find the dung pile or a uh, in defense, uh, find uh, dung pile or, or find out what it is. We did kill the troll, so that's 10 XP. So now this is where we roll. So we find we did find uh, uh, the map. So uh, 
I need there we go. So the map. So we need to for the map we need to roll on the navigation roll. So we're gonna use John. He's got plus three, but he has the vertical star chart, so that's plus um so he's at plus four, so he needs um eb so he rose in nine. So we do uh we've worked out the map. It's to understand it's uh, if Cephaso figures understands the map of log uh, uh the map of leading to this strange growth. So leading to uh, this understanding is the map of leading to a strange growth. So so we've got the map that is I have no idea. It is worth five uh five XP. Now uh, this strange book is found and so we need Archonaut, Archonaut, so Archonaut, so John has Archonaut plus, plus five, I have plus one, uh, I think Michael, Andrew, no, so, Andrew is, wrong Andrew, I got them all, he is, Haley. Archonaut three, so it's John. Again, five plus two. What do we need? I rolled a. Is found. I rerolled that because we got one ability left. We do. Uh, so out uh, because we got one. Um, what's that ability called? Hold on. Hand of Fate left. So because I didn't use it one thing. So we pass. Um, it is plus X eight. P uh, plus fifteen from the from the special XP clue marker. Um mark is recovered, we did recover it, and then it's 20 XP if the file is identified. And this is where I'm gonna shoot myself in the foot because I forgot to um do that. Uh, leave it for that. So we can use to identify it, it is Survival difficult sixteen or Archer Law different call sixteen. It's gonna be again John because he's got Archer Law five. Uh my sci fi uh, my best is armor and leaves it five. So John needs eleven. Come on, John. Oh rows of fifteen. Is a fail. Amazing, isn't fifteen? That we don't identify it. Right, but the good thing is, we found we do found one magical item because the book of um, the if it ended found the book, it comes with a book of law, and I don't know what the hell it is. Of course, it says there's a magical item. Book of Law. I think I carry a Book of Law. Recovers pl receives plus two to all Arkham laws and read room skill rolls. Right. Okay. Um. Right. We. Okay. This is a difficult one now because John. I worked out the book first, and we realised it's the Book of Law. And the Book of Law gives him plus two to read, uh, to all Arkham Law and read rooms. So we worked that out. So John will go, right, okay. If I work that out, we need this, and then he will have that. We wrote a ten. Okay. I want everybody's opinion. Underneath, if you do watch this, uh, this is a big one. Would 
I says because I said special rolled the first one to get the book of law. So if I read it first, I would know what it done, and I should do that always now. Would I pass and will re uh pass the dick uh the Arkham Law sixteen twelve difficult sixteen roll a ten plus five because he's uh, got Arkham Law five because he's the the random one that's worth fifteen in the book. Um there we go. That's all so that's him at the top because they get plus uh Hand weapon, upper law for plus five, read rooms. Um, they're not that bad. They even got uh, will plus two and fight plus two, so there's only not two at Um, and then you mean 15. So, but what's saying? So, plus five, 15. I have now the before that, I found I, I got the book law, and it gets plus two to read rooms and law. So, do I pass that? Because I worked out I've got the book, the book's useful, now I can um able to use it. Um so uh what so what I'm saying would I pass this skill check then? Because I have got um passing the last skill test I realise I've got the book of law plus two or you say no. So please uh comment underneath to say yes you um, I because uh, I worked out the book first, I realised what it does. It gives me the bonus, or no because you roll in at the same time or whatever um, rule. So just comment on me saying yes, I do it. If I do, I realise uh, the tree is life is true, and I also my ranger gets plus twenty XP. So. So yeah, book of law. So, so I won't put the twenty XP in here yet, but it's a hard. So let add all this up. So I got um, twenty, thirty. Eight, eight, eighteen, no, eighteen, sixteen, twenty-four, plus nine, that is six, thirty-three, so that is sixty-seven, I think. And they've got, so, eight, and eight is sixteen, plus four is twenty-four, so five at fifteen, that's twenty, plus ten, thirty. Yeah, that is 67, uh, 67, oh, sorry. So, hold on, do 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 do. 10, oh, sorry, 10, 30, 37, sorry. 6, 3, plus 1, that is... One, three, four, five, six. So yeah, sixty-seven. We got sixty XP. Oh, wow, it works. So I've got uh, zero, nine. I'm oh, sorry, eight, zero. Oh yeah, it's nine. So one thousand and ninety. That uh, I don't think I left. Well, I think I need ten more. If I so that twenty does make a difference. So um, please get back to me as soon as possible because that will be very helpful. Um, because it's I don't know what to do because to me I worked out the book what the book done first and passed it. If I realise what it done, I will. If I, I think you you equip it to and so John he then John have that extra bonus to help him, so or am I or don't you think I'm not allowed to do that? But I don't know. So otherwise, every um survive John is now on seventeen, Andrew's on seven, Haley 
is now 10. She is leveled up. Chloe is on 19. And William, with his little piece of paper, is on 6. So, Haley's now leveled up and she has 13 health. Not uh, for 12 anymore. So, that is it. Um, that is it. So, um, Haley's now um, leveled up. She's now on 13 health and it's a 12. That's some good. Um, uh, we found one sweetness. I'm going to give that, keep that on John. The Book of Law, it's going to go back and forth to Paul and Andrew. Depends who we're taking on it. Uh, because, um, and well, Andrew, John, and Paul, because depends who's going to take. Uh, one had Paul and Andrew the mages. They had one has three rooms, one has Arkham Law, and if John's on the board, he will have that um, have it automatically. So it will depend who goes and what and what. So that one's always in. Um, that's going to be always what can happen with Book Law uh, for who has more purposes. So I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I thought this was quite fun. Uh, some Cole's calls. Um, some really good dice rolls and that's it. So I hope I see you in the next battle phase and many thanks. Bye. And um, what I said, if you please comment underneath about yes, I did pass or no, I don't. Uh, that will help a lot. Uh, and um, I'll let you know. Uh, let me know as well, please. I would be really grateful. I think this is quite important. And that's it. Many thanks. Bye.